I'm gonna drop the number. Whoever calls first, I'm picking up. You either ask for advice, tell a story, say what you want to say. It doesn't matter. It's literally like, just say whatever you want. But we're not going to know who you are, technically. So say whatever you want. You can prank call us, whatever. You could, It literally does not matter. Just, you could call and say whatever. Then, if you call, but I'm already on the phone, it's going to hang up, obviously. Then you guys just fucking, I'm going to call you back in order, okay? Oh, oh somebody call, somebody call, somebody calling. Hello, you're with D&D &D Radio. How about help? <laughs> Stupid ass. What's up? Hey, I just... I wanted to tell a little story about how I was cheating on my ex-boyfriend. Wait, hold on. Why can you, you take, can you take your, your, your thumb off your mic, girl? You sound crazy. Bro, come on with all that shit. For real, man. Come on. <laughs> bro, you we can't low. hear you. Matter of fact, I turn the mic up, bro. Don't hear about it, bro. Go ahead, bro. Did she just... Okay, so I've been with my boyfriend cheating with my cousin. So I had started texting his cousin, but I was catfishing his cousin because I didn't want him to know who I was exactly. Mm -hmm. So then I went to their house after I catfished them, and I was like, okay, I'm going to come over. And then I took his PT, and I sent the you? to my ex-boyfriend. Wait, so why did you catfish them? Because I didn't want him to know it was me, so he didn't tell his cousin. I wanted to, it to be a surprise. <laughs> I'm confused. So you wanted you wanted him? No, listen, my ex cheated on me with my cousin, so I cheated okay. on him with his. So you oh you got you got it back in blood. But but I catfished the cousin, so the cousin didn't know it was me until I got there. You feel me? And then, and then when you got, got there, what happened? He didn't, he didn't say no, so I did what I had to do. I set the camera up and we did the name. You recorded it? You were, do they know that you recorded yes, it? Y'all niggas. Y'all niggas is easy. Did I sent it to him? Didn't I just say I sent it to him? She said niggas. Wait, 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 wait. So you fucked that nigga or whatever the hell, and then you sent the video to the other nigga? <laughs> yes, I sent it back to his cousin. What the cousin say? Nothing. They just, you know, I can't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> no, what they say? Oh my god, he said some crazy stuff. He told my mama, he sent the video to my daddy. Baby. Your father? Okay, first of all, girl, are you fucking stupid? So you tell me you said you sent the video to the nigga knowing he has your family's contact and he sent it to your family. Was your face in the video? I do what I need to do. Yes, I was fucking sick, bro. I'm not that type of person no more, but how no. do y'all feel like How long ago was this? It was like a year and a half ago. Damn! Um, okay, well, here's my personal opinion. Um, I feel like you definitely got it back in blood, literally, with his blood. Um, but, you know. I ain't gonna lie, he did. He ate that one little thing up when he sent it to my daddy. I was so sad. What's your dad said? Bro, my daddy is not American. He's from Jamaica. He disowned me for a couple months. I ain't gonna lie. I'm so in love with you and I fuck your dick too, but bye bye. Wait, you said it. What did she just say? <laughs> I'm sorry. She said she's in love with you and she'll suck your. D you're on. Hello, you're on air. Hello. Hello, sweet page. Girl. <laughs> Hello, mysterious caller. Hello. Hello, uh, what's no, going on? My name is Pat. My name is Patsy. Nice to meet y'all. Your name is Patsy. Uh, Patsy, yes. Yeah, so basically, I. Uh, okay, I went out with this guy. A vacation, right? I went out mm -hmm. to Cancun, Mexico. You know, I went out there for a fun time. Me and my husband Gerald just went out there for our, you know, our ten-year uh, marriage anniversary. Okay. Um, okay. We've been married for about we've been married for about ten years now. Congratulations. And, you know, we're, we're, thank you so much. Uh, but my thing was right. So there was a time where he was just too tired, didn't want to go out, didn't want to do shit. So I decided to explore the Mexican city myself. All right, 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 right. I decided to go out and see what these beaters are about. So I went out there, right, and I, I met this I met this bartender. His name was Julio. Don Julio, mm-hmm. He sure did. Give me some Don Julio. Um, <laughs> I don't just mean to drink either, so that's kind of what I'm calling about. Okay. Um, my, my... My husband don't know. He don't watch the stream either. So if any of y'all send it to my husband, I know who y'all are. I will find you. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Basically, um, I don't know how to tell Gerald that I want to leave him for Julio. So Julio Wait, put Julio, it down better than Gerald. So you're giving up 10 oh, years. He for sure didn't want to tell you. He put down that enchilada with the Verde sauce. 
Okay. 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 No, 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 we're not laughing. We seen a roast. No, I, I hear one of y'all big necks laughing. Who is it? Big necks? First of all, watch who the hell you're talking to. <laughs> oh, you know. Um, so you're telling me <laughs> you want, you want, what, what's his name? Don Julio. I mean, Julio, not Don. <laughs> so Julio, Julio. Is Julio, can Julio even get to the States? I mean, you know, once we get this figured out with Gerald, I can get him a green card. Type shit. Type. Does Julio speak English? We gotta use Google Translate, but that's Oh not brother! <laughs> does Julio know about Gerald? Yes, he does. Oh goodness gracious, Julio's a messy ass bitch. <laughs> okay, so no, he's for real messy as hell. Okay. <laughs> so <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. Girl, that left that was not disgusting. Cute. Uh I, so so you're you're asking us how should you tell Gerald? How do I let it's like I don't want to just like, you know, we just celebrated our 10 year. Yeah, yeah, and you, and got, you ruined it. No, hey, shut the hell up. That's not the point. I'm asking you for advice. Don't clock me right now. Listen here, P um, Pepsi, Betsy, so whatever your name is. Listen, you fucking fumbled. Gerald, he probably was a cool dude. You feel me? He paid for Ten a trip to Mexico no, for you. He couldn't lay it down. Listen, let me tell you, he started getting wrecked how to funk, uh, dis dysfunction back in 2000. Oh, Gerald can't fuck? Right. No, he can't fuck. Wait, Damn. so he used to be able to fuck? He, well, yeah, we got about two kids together. <laughs> Damn! Patsy, you nasty. No, don't, don't talk to me like that. I'm with Julio right now. You can't be talking to me like that. <laughs> Listen, I think you should... Oh, why do I have an accent? <laughs> I think like, you should be... Here's my thing. Here's my thing, mm. right? I don't want to just slap it in Gerald's face like... Hey, by the way, fuck somebody else, and you're not good enough. Um, want to leave? No, just you have to break, break up with him. You have to break up with him. Get get no, the divorce yeah, papers ready. Like, I can't just stay. I can't just stay with him after that. Do you know how terrible I feel? Girl, so you like, should have already felt terrible. I just, I just want because he's still a great person. Don't get me wrong. Like, I'm not gonna lie. He's still a great person. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I don't care. But it don't matter because his dick don't work. Well, yeah, his dick don't work, but like, he still got a good personality. Well, obviously, it's not up for you, because Julio don't even speak English, and you fucking him. Julio, Google translated his way into your draws. Absolutely. Okay, Look, let's hear it, Patsy. You're lost. Patsy, Patsy, Patsy. No, you've been on the line for too long, Patsy. Listen, Patsy, I need you to tell Gerald straight up to his face that you're a fucking cheater and that you don't deserve him. Okay? <laughs> bye, bye, Patsy. Bye, Patsy. Yo, yo, yo. You're on D&D &D Radio. Hey, guys. Hey. How are y'all? We're good. good. How are you? I'm good. Okay, so anyways, if I go to Orlando, right? Right. Um, and I get an Airbnb, are y'all going to pull up? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> y'all asking too many questions. I don't think y'all want to pull up to a and I don't know who the owner is. No, you're gonna be with me. It's okay. It's all right. Oh, <laughs> you're bold. I think I like it. Hold on. So, what you look like? Describe yourself. Right. Brown skin, about five two and a quarter. Um, Caribbean. Um, can cook. Um, what you cook? What you want me to cook for you, Darnell? Oh my <laughs> goodness, she is applying pressure. No, I take I take any food. I just want to know what was your best dish. Everything, I guess. Damn. You know, Darnell needs to stop playing with me. Okay, so basically, you want Darnell? Yes. Sir. I'll sell him to you for like five dollars. Five. Okay, five dollars and a biggie bag. Deal. <laughs> <laughs> you are, you're sick. No, hey, wait, wait. So you said B and B. Is it just gonna be you and this B and B? No, I'm not that sticky. Oh, so you have friends? Yeah. How many friends you got? I got homeboys. Hey, no cap. How many? How many you got? We got. Mm -hmm. I got. There, by, I got. By, I there's got seven by. us. There's seven of us in all. Right. 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 Okay, I can work for that. I got that. Tight shit. Tight That's shit. Like you, you, you go. You gonna send us your friends? Six people. Yeah, it's gonna be sixty people left over because I'm already gonna have Darnell. So I, I, I know that's right. So I'm gonna send. I'm gonna send you my homeboys. You gonna send me your homegirls, and then I. I you know what I mean? All right. Tight <laughs> that. shit. That's how you do business, nigga. Come on, bro. Damn, nigga, right. Team, Rita, hums up. Pack your bag. <laughs> Whoa, actually, not hums up. Damn, I forgot. <laughs> Hello, you're on D&D &D Radio. Hello? Hey, um, my name's Gerald, all right? 
Wait, wait, you say your name, Gerald? My name's Gerald, yeah. Okay, okay. okay. So, me and my wife, we celebrated our 10-year anniversary uh, in Cancun. So, when we got there, right, so my wife, <laughs> there's no real way to say this without making myself sound like a piece of shit, all right? Okay. All right. My wife thinks I have erectile dysfunction. Things. I don't have erectile dysfunction. It's oh. just after she had our second child, she let go of herself. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say my soldier doesn't stand about attention for her anymore. Oh. So when we were on the resort, um, I told her I was tired one night because she, she had a couple of drinks. She was drinking a lot of Don Julio. I don't know where she kept getting it from. Yeah, I wonder. Right. I wonder. Why are you saying that? Oh, just saying. No, Continue. I, so she was drinking out Don Julio. Act of Julio, yeah. Okay, yeah. So she was, you know, kind of microdosing the alcohol all day. And then it got to that point in the day where she was drunk and she wanted to, you know, do what grown folks do when they're grown in her day. And you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Right, 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 right. But I told her I was tired because I didn't, you know, I mean, I mean if you've seen her, <laughs> I can't just imagine. Have you ever filled up a water balloon, right? If you turn it upside down and hold it by the tie, she's built like that. <laughs> oh, she's built so, like an un- upside down water balloon. Yeah. So okay. I told her. Um, I told her. I told her I was tired. I wasn't really tired. I just didn't want to have sex with you. You know what I'm saying? Right. So I started snoring, faking like I was asleep, and then I heard her get out of the bed and leave the room. So oh, oh, when shit. she left the room, there was this maid that came by. And said, your wife has been spending a lot of time down at the bar. Mm-hmm. And I was like, okay, that's odd. Um, but also, it's 11 o'clock at night. Why are you coming to my room? Uh, <laughs> she said that she had been eyeing me for a while since we checked into the resort. And uh, I think that my wife cheated on me when she went down to the bar. But I cheated on her in the room just in case she cheated on me. Did that Bitch, you did a safety <laughs> precaution? Wait, but, but what if she didn't cheat? So, then then that's a risk I'm willing to take because I think at this point in the marriage, I think that, you know, we kind of don't have anything to offer each other anymore. Like right, we have our kids. Right. Um, but like, so, like, what should I do? Should I confront her about leaving the room to go talk to the guy at the bar? Because the, the maid pretty much snitched on her, all right? Right, mm-hmm. right, 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 right. So, I, I know what happened. Yeah, so I, I say you confront her. Knowing that she was doing what she was doing. So when I confront her, do I tell her that I cheated or do I kind of take it to the grave and just play the victim? Um, that's a great question. Well, Gerald, I'm going to be honest with you. Um, you are wrong as fuck for cheating in advance when you didn't know yet. But how about you confront her? If she says she cheated, then you say, ah, ha ha, because I cheated too. Ah, gotcha, bitch. And then you fucking cheated too. Right, and then right. y'all can both go. But, yeah. but also, but, but listen, right? So, oh man, I'm just going to sound like a shitty person. So, I'm, I'm a very, I love manipulating people, all right? Okay, so that's weird. If, if I confront her about it and she tells me the truth, I now have leverage that I can use to kind of get whatever I want. And... I can make her the bad guy to my kids so my kids don't think less of me. <laughs> you let us you know. Can't, you, can't, you can't get on the horse with. Oh, fuck. I just want to come on Gerald by accident. Hello? Oh, wait. Gerald calling back. Hold on. I'm going to put you on hold. <laughs> Sorry, G- G- Gerald? Stop calling me! I, I just really don't know what to do. Like, should I confront my wife? Should I, you know, let it be considering I, I did? Um, Mind you, like, this is this is 10 years down the line. I just paid for our vacation to Cancun, and, you know, she goes and fucks some <laughs> Spanish-speaking bartender. <laughs> in, in my situation, what would you do? Well, I wouldn't have cheated in the first place because I'm not a fucking piece of shit, but uh, since you already did that, I guess... But, um, but also, you know, she cheated, you know? Right, you don't we don't know, know that, that yet, but well, you don't know that. So, yeah, so, <laughs> so me personally, it's what like... Do you know something? No, about I don't. Know. I don't know. I don't even know. I don't even know your wife's name. What's your What's your wife's name? Did she call you? No, no. She, no. Who's your wife? You. Bitch, forgot. What's your wife's <laughs> name, nigga? <laughs> pa- wait, 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 wait. I got. I got. I got. I got. What's your wife's name, <clears throat> Patsy? <clears throat> um, my name. My wife's name is Patsy. What? I would have never That's guessed. Crazy. I would have never guessed. Okay. <laughs> 
So yeah, so the fact that you couldn't remember her fucking she name. Like mine, and she likes sweet tea and Don Julio for some reason. I don't know. Yeah. Sweet tea and Don Julio is a crazy <laughs> combo. Your wife must be black. <laughs> Are you out of your mind? You think I? You think Wait, you what? You think you what? <laughs> Joe, get off my phone, Gerald. Hello, you on hold? I How you doing, Julio? <laughs> Hello, Julio. Welcome to D&D Station. How may I help you? And, um, so, like, so I met this woman, right? She was, um, she said she was married, but, like, I really like her, you know? Do right. And, like, um, so, like, I met her in Cancun, and everything was all good, everything was great, and... She kept talking about how her husband was not really a good guy, and, and, and uh, she kept mentioning something about like dysfunctional reptiles or something like oh. that. <laughs> that's just, that's just <laughs> reptiles. Okay. Hey, yes, yes, your reptile dysfunction. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. So like, yeah, it's so, like, so, like, here's the thing: it's like when when you know when we did when we did, when we did the salsa, when we did the tango, right? So like, what happened was, I I, I don't think I pulled out. What? what? Holy, are you a oh, fucking, like, are you a fucking, how do you say stupid in Spanish? <laughs> el stupido. So, like, are you el stupido? So like, here's, so, like, here's my thing, right? So, like, I'm kind of concerned there might be, like, a little Julio Jr. out there. Like, I don't know, though, you know what I mean? But, I mean, listen, well, you won't know, do you even have her phone number? No, but I, like, I think she, she said her name was, like, Betsy or Betsy or something along those lines. And so I was, like, I, I, I'm trying to remember, you know what I mean? <laughs> you have WhatsApp? Oh, yeah, man. What's up? I talked to my nephew over in America. Ah, Dios mío. I'm not really good with the balls and things, though. You know what I mean? Because I'm a You know, I'm kind of old, so it's like... I'm not, I'm not really talking with it. Well, you have to hit her up on either WhatsApp or Facebook. No, fuck that. Julio, they don't got condom in Cancun. You just have to fuck raw and nut in her? But, like, here's my thing, though, right? So, like, at the end of the day, like, it was a spur and a woman thing. Like, we were both out there, Don Julio. She said, she oh, said yeah. Julio. I said, oh, okay. So, you know what I mean? I don't know what you mean. <laughs> but, um, okay. So, now you're going to have to worry about a little Don Julio Jr. Don Julio shots. <laughs> Just a shot of Don Julio but like, running around. But, but, like, here's the thing, right? Here's the thing, right? Like, she said she was married. So, like, what if I don't even got a couple of kids? Oh like, yeah, you're like, fine. Like what if it's a, like what if she said that her husband types it? Yeah, you're gonna have to fight her husband. Are you ready for that? But like, but like you never know. Though the baby could come a little maracas or something, and then the whole situation is all fucked up. Julio, I have a question. Did you know she had a husband when you were nutting in her? I'm not gonna lie. I'm being completely honest with you. <laughs> Yeah. I don't, See, I, I don't know what I was thinking in the situation, man. You know, you you weren't thinking. That's your fucking problem. I do a lot of odd jobs. I do a lot of odd jobs. And besides, you know, plumbing, construction, electrical, and things like that. So, like, you know, I was just a plumber trying to fill a crack, man. A plumber trying to fill the crack. What's her husband's name? Harold? Okay, so Harold, right? <laughs> just by just judging by the name, he sounds like he owns a shotgun, right? He sounds like he means business. I would run. Well, hey, man. Well, hey, man. You don't know about me. I got connections on doors, man. I mean, like, I love you doing the thing, you know what I'm saying? I'm just hopeless now. I can't think any worse shit. My bad. <laughs> Was that Taylor? That was Taylor the whole time. You didn't know that was Taylor. You didn't realize? Taylor fucking snapped. I realized at one point. No. I, I realized at he one point. He fucking snapped. It's Hello? You're on air? Hey, um, calling back. So, there's something from a wife. Yeah, I said Okay. Oh, sorry. This is Gerald, by the way. Okay. Um, yeah. She had some very disturbing news for me. Okay. But apparently, well, you know, the suspicions were true. She admitted to cheating on me. Um, well, you know, I kind of got my get back that same day, so I'm not really too much mad about that. Right. Um, but she's been calling him on an international phone call and wiring him money. <coughs> How much money are we talking? Mind you, Mo, she's been sending him about $1,000 a week. Damn! Mind you, she does not work. So, <laughs> 
she's sending this man money from my account. Oh, goodness gracious. Hmm. Um, oh. So I just... Jared, how long has I this been going on for? Back. Well, our 10-year anniversary was back at the end of July. So it's been probably about two, three weeks. So she sent a total of $3,000. Oh, my goodness. You, you, you got money? <laughs> Is the sky blue? <laughs> <laughs> I think she already won. <laughs> Well, she's telling me it's hush money because she experienced something illegal down there. I don't know whether to believe her or not, though. Because she said he was involved with some cartels and some drug running and stuff. I don't know how. Wow. That, but you're working at, but you're working at a resort. <laughs> giving people shots and pina coladas and shit. I just feel as if you're in that type of activity. You know, putting yourself around foreigners isn't really the best course of action. But should I believe her? Because I don't think it's hush money. <laughs> I think she's been very desperate to kind of get some pain uh, after all these years. And I just think... You ain't fucked her in years? Moved. So we had our second child back in 2018. Um, and she started to let herself go around COVID time. So you haven't fucked her in four so years? So it's been, it's been about four years, yeah. <laughs> Damn. Her weight starts with a three, all right? Okay, Joe. Joe, Joe, I think we're done, we're done here, okay? If you, could, if you could imagine a refrigerator, that's her. Get off my phone. Where the fuck is Patsy? Who's <laughs> Hello? Hello? Uh, oh, hello! Hey, uh, it's Patsy. Oh, I would have never guessed. Hey, Patsy, welcome back. <laughs> I'm with Julio right now. He made me some, some tacos. I just left my husband, Gerald, uh, after I just told him the news that I, I was with Julio. So I'm on the way to go see Julio right now. Oh, my goodness. You fucking whore. So, <laughs> no, I'm not a whore. I'm just horny. There's a difference, okay? Okay, there's something I left out because that's why I said I'm not Patsy, okay? So I'm not Patsy, all right? Hypothetically speaking, let's say a woman named Patsy, um... Went to Cancun, met a man named Julio, um, dilly dallied with his hooli hooli dooly, and um, uh, now we might be having a shot at the throne running around here. Um, on top of that, um, why well, just figure out that Julio, his brother is El Chapo. What? Yeah. So. His brother's El Chapo, which means now I got a drug baby. Do I bring them together and, like, get some taquitos and carne asada tacos and nachos <laughs> and margaritas? Except mine's a virgin margarita. You know what? Like, I've had enough of this. I need Julio, Gerald, and Patsy. I know you're all watching. Send me a dot right now. We're going to get to the bottom of this. Not to be messy. Oh, this is going to be a group call, all right? <laughs> Hello? Hello! Hey, can I... You stay right there! I... Alright, can everybody hear me? Yeah. What the hell do you mean, everybody? <clears throat> Patsy? Patsy, this is, this is, this is, uh, what's his name? Gerald. Gerald, this is Patsy. Patsy! Hey, fuck that! I'm talking, nigga, I'm the host! Patsy, do you got something to say to Gerald? Oh, you're so fucking corny. No, no, don't mind, don't mind that. You're getting Don Julio from a dude named Julio? Could you that, be any not, more reason? That's not, that, that's not why I need you here. I brought you here today to let you know I am, I'm pregnant. Uh. You're what? <laughs> I, 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 got, I got a fetus in the bay. Hold on, hold the thought, hold the thought. Julio, pick up, bitch! It's not what you think it is, okay? It's yours. What the hell do you mean it's not what I... It's mine. You're yes. not going to tell me it's mine and I haven't touched you in four years, Patsy. 
Don't lie like I didn't just do what I did back in Mexico. Please. Yeah, we know what you did back in Mexico. That's why the fuck are you? Oh, yeah. Here. You know what I did because Julio taught me what to do with you. Oh. You didn't do anything to me. You must have had me confused with some other fuck down there. Gerald. Hello? <laughs> Patsy. Yes. And Don Julio. I did. Wait, what the hell is he talking about keys for? So, <laughs> I, I may have dilly dallied outside of my comfort zone a little bit. And, uh, did she change her Discord name? Um, <laughs> uh, you got a kooky gremlin about to run around. Um, well, you're saying you dilly dally. We, we got baby number three on the way. I Damn! Know we, wait, wait, wait. wait. Right. Wait, oh, Patsy. Baby on the week? Congratulations. Wait. <laughs> you shut the hell up. Thank you, Julio. Thank you so much. Oh, you glazing. I'm glad to see you guys procreating. Brown boy. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. 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 Yeah
Never said that was my baby. You know, you have no proof. Are you gonna take it? No, hold on, hold on. You gotta take more because it sounds to me like you're trying to get your husband's money back. But listen, I already went to the No, what I want to know is if you're gonna take that baby for that green card. These cousin sisters, Kinsey. I know you're talking about right Kinsey. Let me ask you this, Julio. How bad you want that green card? I already have a green card. I don't know what you're talking about. You take you, your shirt and your box shotgun and go somewhere else, okay? Wait, you, Pat, wait, I got a great Daniel idea. Julio Jr. can go fuck off, all right? <laughs> I could care less what the hell happens to either okay, three of them. Okay, but for you, for you, my friend, she's Patsy. For me, she was Patsy. Wait, Patsy. I got a great idea. We could just trade the baby for six kilos of cocaine, <laughs> and then we make tons of money, pay off our mortgage, and live happily ever after. Forget Don Julio. We what? Oh, and we have Who's going to tell this chinquita that I don't deal in cocaine now? The maid, because the maid told me, and guess what? Me and the maid did after you that fat neck ass maid. Mm. Oh, you worried about a fat neck, but you got a fat neck. Hey, Harold, you watched your mouth man. talking about Maria, too. Maria, hey, Harold, Maria. I, think, I, think gig, I think that gig is on, man. I think, you should, tell her what, I think you should just tell her what really went on, man. What the hell what are you, you talking about? What really went on? What happened? Julio, do you know something? You see, it wasn't the maid that told him that you were leaving the room to come see me. It was me. For what? Okay, I'm going to let them talk to themselves. Hey, y'all done with this or no? Uh, hello? Hello? Who's, hello? Hello, you're on DDR? Hello? Hello? Hello, nigga? I heard you say you wanted somebody with a regular voice, man. What? A, I, okay. It's, hello? <laughs> bitch, I hear you. How may I help you? Okay. <laughs> you called me, man. What's wrong? Let me say something, fuck, nigga. I did not call your bitch ass, okay? What the shit are you talking about, man? You fucking called me. You, you called me. D in the air. This is a radio station. We're giving out advice. Do you need advice? You called me. You. You. I fucking. I will get. I will angry. I you will. You let me talk. When I. When I talk. When I, when I fucking talk. You let me talk. I'm sorry, Hello? sir. I'm, yes, sir. We're here. Yes, sir. Go ahead. <laughs> sir, the floor you is yours. Fucking call me. <laughs> you fucking call me. You fucking asked me. Fix my... Huh? Good. Go on. Go ahead. Go ahead. I said you fucking call me. I fucking over here preparing all this fucking food, man, for my fucking family. I'm working fucking tired job and shit. I call you call me asking for computer problem. I'm, I'm helping you. Your fucking birth or shit. You text me about it. You let me text me. Bertha? Bitch, Bertha? Four years ago? Four months, 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 fuck, man. Have a good day, bro. <laughs> Why do you come from a 954 number? I was trying to figure out. I'm like, who the hell? What the, the fuck? From the bro, I don't give a fuck. This, is, this idea was fucking amazing. Hello? Don't you fucking hang up on me, man. You say bye first thing, first thing. Hang up on my nigga, I don't need tech support. I am not your nigga. <laughs> my computer works perfectly. Well, not perfect. My computer works fine. I don't need your help. Okay, then who the fuck, who the fuck is this, man? How you gonna call us back and ask us who this is? Brother, first your fucking guy with computer broken, then your fucking sex chat guy. Sex chat? Guy. All right, bro, that's, that segment is, oh, it's over. It's over!